Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So last week I posted a video about some hidden features that were spotted in the latest dev channel build, 25300. And one or two of those features, just to do a quick recap, were I'm ending a task without using the task manager and a new volume mixer. And I'll leave a link to that video in the description um, if you'd like to keep up to speed as to hidden features that Microsoft could be working on internally. And as mentioned previously on this channel, hidden features are code that Microsoft um, does not announce officially in any release notes for any uh, any different build. And as mentioned, could be code and features they are working on internally, which could roll out for official testing in up and coming builds. Now, it seems that build 25300 uh, is packed with hidden features. And once again, we have more hidden features that have, that have been spotted in last week's dev channel build. And these first couple were spotted by the Windows enthusiast Albacore over on Twitter. Now, just to give you a kind of general idea as to the first new feature, currently in the uh, stable version of Windows 11, if we head over to our settings app and on the system page, we click on storage and we head down to where we get advanced storage settings. Here we get our disks and volumes where you can view and manage properties of your disks and volumes your disks and volumes. Now the first new hidden feature uh, is virtual disk creation. Seems that it may uh, be coming to the disks and volumes page in the future. And if you just head over to a screenshot provided by Albacore on, uh, over on Twitter, we can see uh, on the same page, um, create a virtual hard disk. And if you click on that tab, head into the next screenshot, you have some um, options to create a virtual hard disk. You can rename it, its location, virtual hard disk format, VHD or VHDX, and virtual hard disk type, uh, fixed size, which is recommended and dynamically uh, expanding. So it seems that that could be something Microsoft uh, is testing internally, where um, in build 25300, um, you can create a virtual disk uh, in the settings um, on that actual page, as mentioned which is currently unavailable in the stable version. And then heading to the next hidden feature, also spotted by Albacore, um, it seems that the home page for the settings um, could be getting a new home view. Now, because it's still early days and this is a hidden feature, obviously this is blank and there's nothing going on at the moment, but uh, there could be a um, possibility that Microsoft is working on a new home redesign for the settings app and if anything does change uh, in that direction I will obviously post and let you know accordingly and then as mentioned uh, in an earlier dev channel build we are possibly getting a new gallery um, for the uh, file explorer which um, is going to be very similar to pictures but here we can see there's been a bit of an update and also in build 25300 um, it seems that the gallery app uh, is going to be very similar to photos because here we get a timeline and uh, as we can see um, just an overview of your different images and photos stored um, in your pictures but nonetheless looking very much like the photos app and that's going to be um, here, uh, in the left hand menu navigation pane for the file explorer gallery and that could soon be coming uh, to um, uh, the file explorer hopefully and possibly in one of the moment or feature updates rolling out this year for windows 11 and then the um, final screenshots now the this is a little bit different and change in direction a little bit here and uh, these new emoji were spotted by phantom ocean 3 over on twitter and uh, um, this is the um, new support for emoji 15 which could be coming soon to windows 11 and was also spotted in build 25300. So as I mentioned, a lot going on in build 25300. Now I do apologize for the quality of these screenshots. It is a little bit a little bit gritty, but um, nonetheless, you'll get the general idea. Now companies like um, Google and Meta have started working on bringing um, Emoji 15 to their respective and various platforms. And obviously now in Windows 11 inside a preview build 25300, um, that's the build as mentioned for the dev channel this has an early version of unicode 15 emojis and these squares are just basically placeholders for emoji that could be rolling out in the future so currently no 3d emojis yet still 2d but nonetheless um emoji 15 now also spotted in build 25300 so that's just a bit of an indication as to some of the um latest hidden features spotted uh, in that latest dev channel build so obviously that build has been packed with 
possible features that Microsoft could roll out for official testing in up and coming preview builds. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.